In this demonstration, we'll take a look at generating a JT Plus PDF output. Once again, access to the publish command is accessible from the file menu or the NXP My Application ribbon bar. In this example, we'll generate a JT Plus PDF. Once selected, the UI is configured to display available templates along with the description and preview for each. Once a template is selected, the command prompts to select the model views to use to publish. Model view options are consistent with the 3D PDF output and include selected, disclosed, and user-defined views. Selection will be made by picking the views from the model view node. An optional setting to specify a password can be used to control the output, as well as user-defined fields and control text fields can be used to control the text output format. In this case, a selection is made. Additional documents can be also attached to the technical data package. In this example, a step file would be attached. Selecting OK will publish the technical data package. The JT plus PDF output is essentially a 2D PDF file with an attached JT file that can be opened in Team Center Visualization or the free JT to Go viewer. When opening a 2D PDF file in JT to Go, the system automatically displays the 2D PDF file as well as the JD JT file in a separate window and tells both in the application. NX Technical Data Package automatically maps the content from the PDF to the JT file. In this solution, the viewport is actually the JT model view, and the view carousel is the table of model views that, when selected, dynamically updates the display of the JT model. Text fields are populated with content defined on Publish, and JT2Go provides a number of tools for controlling the display of the JT model.